Astronomers have confirmed the existence of a galaxy that has remained virtually unchanged for more than 7 billion years. Known as KIDS J0842 plus 0059, this system is what researchers refer to as a fossil galaxy, a relic from the early universe that has avoided the collisions and interactions that typically reshape galaxies over cosmic time. KIDS J0842 plus 0059 was first identified in 2018 through the Kilo Degree Survey, a deep imaging project aimed at studying cosmic structure and dark matter distribution. The galaxy is located around 3 billion light years away. At first glance, it appeared to be a compact elliptical galaxy, common enough, but closer examination revealed unusual features. Despite its large mass, estimated at around 100 billion times that of the Sun, the galaxy was physically small and not forming new stars. Its stars were old, and there were no clear signs of past mergers or interactions. These traits pointed toward a potential fossil galaxy, a system that formed early and then remained dormant. To confirm this, astronomers used the Large Binocular Telescope, its adaptive optics system provided a much sharper image, up to 10 times, the resolution of the original survey data. The new observations allowed researchers to measure the galaxy's structure and stellar population with high precision. The results confirmed that KIDS J0842 plus 0059 is both compact and inactive, matching theoretical models for a galaxy that formed rapidly in the early universe and was never significantly altered afterward. To place it in context, researchers compared it to NGC 1277, a well-known relic galaxy located just 240 million light-years from Earth. It is similarly compact and old, but it exists in a much more evolved region of space and is closer to our time. The most distant fossil galaxy of its kind confirmed so far providing a rare view of what some galaxies may have looked like shortly after formation. This discovery confirms that not all massive galaxies follow the same growth path. Some, like a fossil galaxy, appear to have taken a faster, more isolated route, forming early, burning through their gas, and then remaining frozen in time. What makes KIDS J0842 plus 0059 especially valuable is how it challenges our existing models of galaxy formation. The dominant theory, hierarchical assembly, holds that most galaxies become massive by merging with others over time. Evidence for this process is abundant in the form of tidal debris, warp structures, and mixed-age stellar populations. But a fossil galaxy follows a different script. Its compact structure, uniformly old stars, and lack of merger signatures suggest it formed rapidly, likely in the first one to two billion years after the Big Bang, and then remained untouched. This makes it an ideal case study for early galaxy formation. Because it has avoided later disruptions, its structure and composition closely reflect conditions in the early universe. It allows astronomers to isolate what a galaxy looked like before billions of years of growth and interactions complicated the picture. Another key insight comes from its chemical composition and star formation history. The galaxy shows signs of intense star formation that occurred quickly and ended early. One possible explanation is the presence of a supermassive black hole, which could have heated or expelled gas, halting further star birth. Without cold gas to form new stars, the galaxy remained dormant. These features give astronomers a cleaner environment to model stellar population evolution. Most galaxies have complex star formation histories, with multiple generations of stars forming over time. Fossil galaxies, by contrast, have a single burst population, making them ideal for testing theoretical models. They also help in understanding dark matter, 
In typical galaxies, interactions and mergers can redistribute dark matter and affect how it's observed. In a fossil galaxy, the dark matter halo is likely still in its original state, making it easier to study its shape and influence. The identification of KIDS J0842 plus 0059 adds momentum to a growing area of research, using galactic relics to reconstruct the early universe. The challenge is that these galaxies are extremely rare. Most galaxies have undergone multiple transformations. Finding one that hasn't required both deep surveys and high-resolution imaging, this is where next-generation tools come in. The upcoming Euclid Space Telescope, launched by the European Space Agency, is designed to study dark matter and cosmic structure. But its deep sky imaging and spectroscopy also make it ideal for identifying compact, quiescent galaxies like a fossil galaxy across large swaths of space. Astronomers anticipate that Euclid, combined with telescopes like the Extremely Large Telescope, and continued use of adaptive optics on ground-based observatories will help build a catalog of fossil galaxies at different distances and cosmic epochs. This opens up several avenues of research. With a larger sample, scientists can begin to explore how common are fossil galaxies, what environments do they tend to form in, what factors lead some galaxies to evolve while others remain untouched. These questions tie into larger cosmological themes. For instance, fossil galaxies may help explain why the centers of massive modern galaxies are so dense. It's possible that many of them grew around cores that look just like KIDS J0842 plus 059 billions of years ago. Additionally, these galaxies provide baselines for interpreting more complex systems. Galaxies with merger histories often have overlapping signals from different epochs. Relic galaxies, with their simpler structure, can act as reference templates, helping to deconstruct the evolutionary history of more active galaxies. The confirmation of KIDS J0842 plus 0059 offers a rare glimpse into the early universe. Unlike most galaxies, it has remained unchanged for billions of years making it a powerful tool for studying how massive galaxies first formed. As future surveys uncover more fossils like this, they'll help refine our models and bring us closer to understanding how the universe began.